Hello mga kawawmat, we will continue our review for the second quarter exam in pre-calculus. So the first question is what is sine 5 pi over 6? So we all know class that uh, sine, okay, we all know that sine is equal to the value of y. So first we're going to uh, convert, okay, 5 pi over 6. So, para alam natin kung anong degrees niyan. So, that is 5 times 180. Okay. Pwede yung direct na ganyan. 5 times 180. You can use your calculator. So, that will be... What will be the answer? Okay. So, that is 150. Okay. This is 150 degrees. So, from the unit circle, yung 150 degrees is ito. At... Uh, this will be the coordinates of 150 degrees. Negative square root of 3 over 2 minus 1 half. Since pinapakuha is sines, and then yung sine natin is equal to y, so ito ang negative square root of 3 over 2 is the value of x, yung y naman dito is yung 1 half. So therefore, the correct answer here is letter D. Okay, letter D. So ang una munang ginawa, kinonvert muna natin itong 5 pi over 6 sa degrees. And then, tiningnan natin yung coordinates kung saan. Since ang sign natin, is, that is the value of y at 1 half yung value ng y. So, that will be the answer. Next, what is the value of cosecant 30 degrees? So, where is the cos, uh, the 30 degrees? This one, no? This will be the value of x and this is the value of y. We all know that cosecant 30 degrees is a reciprocal of sign. So, ang sign natin dito class is 1 half. ba? So, kunin natin yung 1 half. Pag kinuha natin yung reciprocal ng 1 half, that is 2. So, therefore, the correct answer here is 2. ba? Ang kabaliktaran nung sign nat ay yung cosecant ay kabaliktaran ni sign. Ang sagot natin sa sign is 1 half. Okay? Sign theta is 1 half. So, what is the value of cos theta? Eh, kabalik na rin lang yan. 2 over 1 or that is 2. So, therefore, the correct answer is letter B. <coughs> Next, what is the reference angle of 120 degrees? So, meron tayong sinusunod para makuha yung reference angle. So, kapag nasa quadrant 1, ayan o, pag nasa quadrant 1, that is... Uh, equal lang din dun sa given Halimbawa, yung given ay 30 degrees So, yung reference angle natin ay 30 degrees din Pero kapag nasa quadrant 2 So, yung 180 ima-minus natin dun sa given na angle Okay, kapag nasa quadrant 3 naman Yung given na angle ima-minus natin sa 180 Sa quadrant 4 naman, 360 minus the given angle So, Yung 120 degrees, saan ba natin matatagpuan yung 120 degrees? Of course, nasa quadrant 2 dito, no? Quadrant 2. So, ano yung sabi dito? Si 180, minus natin sa given na angle. Okay, so therefore, what will be the answer? So, 180 minus 120, so that is 60 degrees. So, the correct answer is letter C. Next. Evaluate sine 0 degrees zero, uh, 0 degree rather So, asan may 0 natin? So, sa unit circle Lagi kayo titingin Nandito yung 0 natin And then, yung sine natin Again, is the value of y So, uh, sa so 1 and 0 Ano yung value ng y dyan? Of course, yung 0 So, therefore Yung sine 0 degree is 0 So, the correct answer is letter C Next Evaluate cosine 180 degrees So, gamit lang yung unit circle Okay Ito yung unit circle natin Ito yung 180 degrees So, again, yung cosine uh, is equal to x So, this is our x, this is our y So, therefore, ang cosine natin is equal to negative, uh, Cosine 180 degrees Ay equal sa negative 1 And that is letter A so that will be the answer for the last question.